James Henry Neidhart, who is better known as Jim the Animal Neidhart, died suddenly on August 12, 2018. Neidhart rose to fame in the World Wrestling Federation, where he was a two-time WWF Tag Team Champion with Bret Hart. He also worked in Extreme Championship Wrestling, World Championship Wrestling, New Japan Wrestling, and on the Canadian Independent Circuit. Neidhart was known for his extreme cackling laugh. He first gained athletic acclaim for his success in strength-oriented track and field events. After graduating from high school, Neidhart pursued a career in the NFL, where he played for the Oakland Raiders and Dallas Cowboys in practices and preseason games. Following his release from the Dallas Cowboys, Neidhart traveled to Calgary to train with Stu Hart and pursue a career in professional wrestling. He worked with Hart's Stampede Wrestling, during which time he married Ellie Hart, one of Stu's daughters. When Stu Hart sold Stampede Wrestling to Vince McMahon, owner of the World Wrestling Federation, he suggested that Bret Hart and Jim Neidhart for a tag team, and thus the Hart Foundation was born. Jimmy Hart became their full-time manager. The Hart Foundation won their first WWF World Tag Team Championship on February 7, 1987, on an episode of Superstars. They defeated the British Bulldogs, David Boy Smith and the Dynamite Kid, with the help of referee Danny Davis who was continually distracted by checking on Dynamite, who was laid out earlier in the match by Jimmy Hart when he hit him with a megaphone. This allowed the Hart Foundation to double team Smith and become tag team champions. Nine Hart and Ellie have three daughters, one of whom, Natalie, is a professional wrestler, and she wrestles on the WWE right now under the rig name Natalia. On August 12, 2018, Jim was having problems sleeping and got out of bed to adjust the thermostat. As Neidhart went to touch it, he fell into the wall and landed on the ground. He died suddenly at the age of 63. Jim was a legend in the business, and his cackling laugh will be missed by all fans, young and old. Thank you, Jim, for all the memories you provided me.